People got their own agenda, which I did not want to do. Ooh, y'all, the traffic is backed up. That's okay, that's okay, girl. We gonna take one step in time. We ain't got time for the dumb shit. I might be broken down, but I'm smiling. I keep my head up high, though I fail. Sometimes I get a bit emotional, but then I turn around and let it. Kit Kats. The motivational thought of the day. Jesus showed us what it means to become love when he spent his last meal with a man he knew would betray him and then willingly died a criminal's death. Hello my Kit Kats and welcome back to a new video. If you are new to my channel, it is simply welcome to my channel. My name is Kate and I hope I am your favorite YouTuber. This is a new year. We got new things to do. And we are going to get it done. We talked about the New Year's resolution, family, friends, finance, and fitness. The four ifs. So, it is currently Sunday night. Went to church. Downloaded my video for tomorrow. Um, right now, I'm on the way to my best friend's house to get some stuff from her. But I have to pick up my godson to come and help me. Y'all know, sister girl getting up there. I, I know when I can't do it. I, I'm admitted. Um, kind of gets to you sometimes because when you ask somebody to do something and they say they're going to do it, you kind of take that they're going to do it. But people got their own agenda. And of course, it didn't get done. So now I'm having to drive across town, which I did not want to do, to go and get something done. You know, when people give you something, you're grateful for it. I mean, you, you are thoroughly, I'm, I'm, I know I am, I am thoroughly grateful for anything someone gives me because they thought enough to call me, say, hey, you want this, whatever, whatever. If I can't use it, someone I know can use it and especially when it comes to like food or something like that you know if I don't eat it or I don't need it there's my mom there's my kids there's my my guard kids there's somebody but these youngsters today don't have that same mentality so with that um, I do what I do. Plain and simple. We're just going to go with that. I'm going to do what I do. Tomorrow I got plans to go to the gym in the morning. So I'm going to go do that. Church was, church was really, really good. And people are getting back into the church after COVID. It took a minute. But they are getting back into the church. And I am definitely trying to be one of those people. So he's trying to get you to be more involved other than just going to church he wants to actually have you do things in, in the church so I'm not much of a lecturer I mean I sing because I feel a spirit but I don't not sure how this went on or went off if it was recording as I said, to go and get some things from her that she had had for me. And like I was saying, it's like you you give people people get want to give you something, and you go ahead and you take it because you appreciate that they actually thought about you enough to say, hey, you know, I got this for you, this, that, and the other. And I'm like, and she has all this stuff in the back of her truck where it's supposed to rain for the next week. So I was like, well, I don't want all this stuff to go bad, so I'm going to her house to pick it up. But I did ask someone to go there and pick it up for me. And of course they didn't, or they were supposed to go back and they did not. So I'm having to drive across town, which I was not that crazy about, but I am driving across town to go do this. I am going to pick up my godson and he says he's gonna help me. He's, he has such a big heart. And he's gonna help me uh, get this stuff lined up. Um, but yeah, 
So it is Sunday night. Church was amazing. Uh, my daughter went to church. That was she surprised me. That was really a surprise, to, you know, to see her at that mass. And afterwards, we went to breakfast, which was nice. And we just got through looking at the first game. I was trying to look at the second game, but uh, get there when I get there. Um, so yeah, I am on the way, and we'll see what we do with that. I I don't know. <laughs> People have changed a lot, and I. I I can't say, you know, I can't get mad because somebody doesn't do anything. I mean, they got their own agenda. But when you tell me you're going to do something, I kind of expect you to do it. But if you not don't want to do it, then tell me you don't want to do it. Or you can't do it or whatever. Then I won't bother you. And in the same sense, I won't give you anything because, it's, well, hell, you help me out. My thing is, normally I go there and get it and I disperse whatever it is to everybody else. But today, I just, it's cold and I really didn't want to get out. So I asked somebody else to do it. And then, but if I ask you to do it and you say no, am I wrong? I mean, I don't know. So, but my godson said he'd help me. So, I guess that, that covers it. Dang, I didn't feel like driving across town. Y'all know I don't drive at night. So this is going to be real interesting. In my video which is gone going better um, so it will download tomorrow I mean it will hit tomorrow and so we were working on our trip we have a big trip a big trip in May and was trying to do one in March but I'm not sure so the whole thing about it was I'm trying to tell Bay I'm not bringing all of this clothes to Europe. I'm not doing it. I always bring all these suitcases and I never wear all of this stuff. So why don't I just bring the leggings that I like to wear, the t-shirts, one dress in case we go out. If we do more than one dinner, I can change the dress up, whatever. Or we're not even going to the same place. So it really doesn't freaking matter. So I'm gonna do that, and I'm not bringing all that jewelry because basically what I wear is what I'm going to refurbish into the different outfits, more or less. Shoes is basically gonna be sandals or one pair of tennis shoes, and my bath and facial self-care stuff. I can cut that down instead of bringing these big old I can get travel so I think I can get it done in a backpack I'm not gonna bring a purse why I bring a purse every time I bring a purse it stays in the hotel room or in the room bedroom until I leave that's crazy so I'm not bringing it I'm not bringing all my computer stuff I am bringing my camera stuff for, for vlogging for you and but I am not going to be bringing all this extra equipment. I'm you know, uh, I got the batteries, I've got the camera, the stand, all that stuff can fit in the backpack, and my phone. I actually think that should be enough. What y'all think? So that's what I'm planning to do. Bay doesn't think I can do it. He wants to do a trial trip to see if I can do it. So we might go to Vegas or something in March. Because he says he doesn't he doesn't think I can do it. I'm not sure I can do it, but we're gonna see if I can do it. <laughs> we're gonna see if I can do it. Oh Lord, I think I was supposed to get out right there. I'm messing with y'all. I done missed my exit. construction well let me get my godson and I will call you back good morning my Kit Kats and welcome back to another day today is June Tuesday June the 
22nd 22nd so I have a couple of runs to make this morning yeah you know this is a new year I told you we're doing a new thing right okay we're concentrating on us so I got up this morning and fixed myself and y'all want to apologize for looking so rough I was looking at some of my videos I scared myself god damn so I said <laughs> I'm going to start taking a few extra minutes in the morning and getting myself together. So I got up this morning. I knew I had some runs to make this morning to physical therapy, the post office. Uh, oh, I got to drop some stuff to my mom. Um, and some other things. And I thought I'd take you along. Ooh, y'all, the traffic is backed up. That's okay, that's okay, girl. We're going to take one step at a time. We ain't got time for the dumb shit. Okay, so yes, I am deciding to take some time, 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 y'all, for myself early in the morning. And it's foggy as shit. <laughs> and the traffic is backed up because people don't know how to drive in the freaking weather. But this is Texas, y'all. This is Texas, you know, this afternoon. See, I got shorts on today. This afternoon, girl, I may be bundled up looking like a little what, uh, a little snow bunny okay <laughs> looking like a little snow bunny so uh and y'all know the other morning i told you how freaking cold it was i told you we had our two days of cold i told you right now it is 65 degrees 65 that's it uh the other morning when i told you it was like 19 20 30 some up in there it was cold whatever it was it was cold I got shorts on today, so that tell you what it is. But I'm bringing the shorts because I got a little physical therapy, and he needs to see my leg. So I said, "Well, I'm gonna go ahead and and do the damn thing." So, and Bay has a CAT scan this morning, so I'm gonna call him after I get out of my physical therapy. I did go to Zumba yesterday, y'all. I did go work out. Bay came with me, so he's pretty pumped about that because. Uh, he can go for free. I mean, because I already paid. So he goes for free. And then he met one of his friends. Every time he goes, this man knows everybody, y'all. Everybody. Uh, he went and saw one of his best friends there working out. So they ended up working out together, which was cool. Uh, and before then, he met another guy I used to work with. I'm like, you know, every time you go, you know more people than I do here. But they worked out yesterday morning and today I told the coordinator y'all need to get something for Tuesday because I don't have nothing on Tuesdays so he said he's going to do a pound class and a Zumba class he's thinking about doing a pop up for that I say sign me up I'm there so today since I don't have anything but my physical therapy which is exercise it's just not as intense that I would like but it is exercise, and I do get a little workout, especially on my leg. So I'm doing that this morning, and then I'm going to go ahead. Oh, I got to pick up some medicine, and then I'm going to run and drop that old cell phone. Y'all, I told you, I got my cell phone finally after a month. A month. I finally got my new cell phone back in. Um, because my old one went out. They kept saying, I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Well, okay, I hear you fine, but apparently you couldn't hear me. So, I had to get in for another phone to be sent to me. Saying that, I have to go send that old one back before they end up charging me. And which is a no-no. The sister girl don't pay for stuff. She ain't got to. Y'all already know me. We try to save the dollar. Y'all, okay, you remember when I started talking about finances for... It's not the end of the month, so we haven't done our check yet. But, uh, trying to do 15 days this month. I don't know if I'm going to make 15 days, but I, for the last two days, I have not spent any, any money. So, that's good. But today, I think I'm going to have to spend, because uh, I need some Amazon to order some, some mic covers. To keep the static down on my camera. I had some. God knows what I did with it. Because I don't looked every... Oh, I got one more spot I can look. No, I took everything out of that. I looked everywhere for it. So, I 
to buy me some more then if worst case scenario I'm gonna have two packs and something else I needed to order today try to do it all on the same day so I can have my full days of spending no money I did spend a little bit more this month than I should have but hopefully next month it'll even itself out uh, if I can get my freaking rent money in, y'all, I have never, never, this is the craziest thing. You rent to people, and they won't pay. I'm, it's, it's, it's the damnedest thing. But I guarantee you, if you was in an apartment with them white people, your ass would pay. But I know me, I got the big heart. So, oh no, that's all right, she, she gonna take it when she get it. I have never been so nickeled and dimed to death in all my life. And realizing, y'all, those y'all rent is my is a business. Those pays bills for somebody else. I don't get it. Girl, they will nickel and dime you to death. And girl, my rent ain't high. I'm sitting up here, you know, you go you go up there to them white folks in, in these damn one bedroom apartments. Here in this little small town, you would get a one bedroom apartment. Somebody walking on your head or whatever in these apartments, thin walls, for eighteen, nineteen hundred dollars. Now that's cheap because we're here. Houston and all that is more than that, but here in this town. $1,800. I got two bedroom houses. Uh, one house is a five bedroom that I do for $950. Uh, a two bedroom house that I do for seven. And I got a, um, another two bedroom house I do for uh, 1000 Only, Only because it, uh, no, 800 Only because you know, it's, you know, locations and stuff. And I'm like, why I can't get my money? I'm, I'm serious. I can't get my money. But you know what? If I ain't got it by the end of the month, I ain't being ugly. I'm just going to have to pay that money. I'm going to have to pay that money, y'all, and go and get this this stuff downtown done. It don't make, what difference does it make? I'm not getting no money anyway. Ooh, get out. Get out. Let it be empty. I have a reason for not getting the money. Baby. But they will stay in there. Girl will give you a story. Now don't get me wrong. There's a, this one lady. She is hustling her ass off. Because she is a single mom. And I do have a big heart for her. Because honey I know what her kids is putting the rug through. And baby I do work with her. But baby if she can pay her money. And these other people can't pay their money. Come on now. Come on. I bet it was them white folks said, oh, you ain't got your money on the first, you got to go. I bet you, you ain't got nothing to say then. Girl, ooh, these people. Well, y'all please let me over. Because this one in front of me about ready to make me lose my little religion I got this Sunday. Oh, my Jesus. I can't take this one no more. I don't know what's wrong with your ass. He's sitting up there holding that wheel like he is scared to death. Get off the freaking freeway. Get on the service road. I know the fog is bad. I mean, shoot, I'm trying not to be late for the appointment. Yeah, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm bitten early this morning. I'm sorry. Girl, I got issues. I, look, I told y'all I'm not prayed up yet. I'm a work in progress. I am definitely a work in progress. <sighs> y'all, let me get over here and, and get to this physical therapy before I, I, I change my mind. Yeah, that would. Nah, I need my leg right, girl. Vacation is coming up. Then I'm trying to find a little vacate, uh, Vegas. My daughter and I, let me say this. My daughter and I are going to start doing a mommy daughter trip every year hopefully i can get my mom to do it but my dad's kind of you know so he she may or may not depending on how long the trip will be 
she likes cruises and stuff like that but I'm just thinking about a nice trip just a getaway massage whatever something like that once a year so I tell my daughter we can take a small one this year and then next year we just save our money and get a larger one because you know she wants she's a, you know she pays her own way in you know that type of thing so giving her an opportunity to get our, our, our money right the Lord knows we like to shop when we go somewhere and uh, then me and Bay taking our trips that we have so uh, that's part of that New Year's resolution that bonding we were talking about so that's something we're gonna look forward to building memories all these gifts and stuff and all that eh, whatever but if you build a memory with someone then you have that to build on uh, maybe I can get my daughter-in-law to go which would be really nice um, we'll do that and uh, yeah do that for this year so the next year we we'll, can plan it for next year also because you're really planning your those big big well i am i am planning my big trips a year out in advance uh so i can get everything right because baby i don't like to be in debt for nothing i like to pay for it up front And I'm not getting kickbacks from no kind of sponsors. So, honey, this is all coming out of Sister Girl pocket. And I ain't got a problem with that because Sister Girl likes to go. Yes, we do. And I have not taken any real trips since my Turks trip. Other than Dallas and New Orleans and that type of stuff. But those are, you know, quick trips. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try to get that done. One for I think my daughter and I we don't go to Cancun we're gonna go to Miami one or the other I'm trying to debate which way we're gonna go for this year next year Bay and I going to Alaska and we're going to Europe for my birthday this year in May and Vegas probably in March I'm thinking and then we're going to uh, a couple of concerts and stuff local you know Louisiana that type of thing at the casinos so yeah y'all we, we we working it out uh, but I'm really trying to figure out if y'all got some suggestions well, me and my daughter really need to go. Y'all, watch the pockets now. Um, and I live in Texas, so think about where we can go for a mommy-daughter uh, trip. That's why I was thinking about Miami. I thought about Cancun. And... I'm not a really big, she's like me, she doesn't like big, like, uh, New York type things. We, we're, we're not, I mean, I go to New York, we'll probably end up shopping or some stuff. But, you know, we, we like to see, we like to shop to the extent of seeing fashions and redoing. Because, baby, sister girl is not going to pay $2,000 for a shirt. I'm not doing it. Not doing it. Nope. Nope. Not doing it. No, sister girl, don't wear. I like clothes too much. So if I could dupe it and 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 change it up and find the style somewhere else, so I do look at styles and I look at how they put things together, and that's what I work on how I match up my clothes. Because some things I would have never put together, but when they put, I thought oh, that's really cute. So, yeah, I look at it that way. Uh, we like wholesale districts. We like we like stuff like that. Um, we like different types of pretty foods. Yeah, we do. Nah, I may spend a fortune on some food because I, I like pretty food. Uh, we like beaches. She loves anything warm. She says she's not, she don't get cold. She, no, mm -mm. she don't do cold. I don't blame her. Mm-mm. So we're doing anywhere warm, warm. So, um, yeah, 
I'm trying to think of a quick trip for this year. And right now, I'm thinking, I thought about doing spring break, but we're too old for spring break. So, yeah, if y'all think of something, let me, give me a suggestion of, you know, what to look up and maybe even, you know, some kind of deals or something that's going on. That would be awesome. But y'all, I'm fixing to get up in this physical therapist and I will hit y'all when you get out. Mwah. Okay, kitty cats, I have broke a sweat. Okay. I am, ooh, fix yourself, fix yourself. I, uh, let's see. Let's go drop this phone off before these people charge me something. And I can check my post box, post office box when I'm at it. And um, then I can get my medicine, y'all. I need to get my medicine. I need to call Bay and see if he good. I wear my phone, y'all. Got my phone. I didn't even check on my baby, y'all. I'm slipping. I am slipping. Keep doing online shopping. No one's gonna be at that goddamn mall. <laughs> Just fucking shut. Please keep this economy going. We need Walmart to be thriving. <laughs> driving me around all day, and I go, you know, because where, whatever city I come to, I always want to, like, where can I go? Like, I want to go, like, not Starbucks, I want to go, like, a coffee shop, a local business, I want to support it. Where's it good? I go, where? Vinny, <laughs> 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 like, my, the guy that opens it, Vinny, he goes, he goes, hey, what's up, what's, where do you guys go for fun? Here. And then she goes, we leave. <laughs> You 
regret it, I forgive it, but you stay the same. You should cry an ocean for me. For the dumb shit and the damage you've done. Cause I've been crying oceans for weeks. Try to fight it, but I'm drowning alone. Thank you so much for watching this video.
If you have not at this time, please like, subscribe, and share. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Stay safe and much love. I might be broken down, but I'm smiling.